welcome back to the channel. This is the second sewer fest of the year. This is in August. And as you can see, there's a full house. Okay, let's go see some really cool animals. All right, so let's begin with the table that I believe is actually new to this show. We actually met them in Schamburg just a couple of months ago. <laughs> Key. Okay, so they are uh, Euromastic breeders. Uh, these are all uh, different species of Euromastics. Those are babies. And to be honest, I was also offered candy uh, to, to record this table first. <laughs> so that's why we're starting here. But no, no, seriously, um, you know, look at, look at this beautiful lizard. Something that you rarely see are actually captive bred butterfly agamas. So that is freaking awesome because every single time that I see them, they are always dehydrated and most likely uh, full of parasites. So it's really cool to see uh, captive bred ones here. So this is a Euromastic Tomasi. This is actually the only Euromastic species that doesn't have a long tail. It is kind of a like a paddle. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know how, how you would call it. But this is this is a really nice species. Look at that guy. Man, look at this guy. This is insane. This is a Euromastic Geminensis. And look, look at those colors. <laughs> that is so freaking cool. Man, how about the one that I, everybody knows, the ornate. So this is obviously a male. Males are the ones that look the best. This is beautiful. I am so happy that I turned on the light. Look at that face. That's cool. As I previously said, I'm always going to record this table, Badgerland Reptile Rescue. I will definitely be getting a couple of plants from them. But of course, let's show some animals. So these are, I believe these are ambassador animals. So they are not, uh, you know, they are not ad adaptable, but it's always nice to see them. Hey, where are you, where are you going, sir? Ma'am. She actually has really nice colors. She's gorgeous. Yeah. So that is actually a corn snake. All right, how about we change into something a little bit different, some tarantulas. to record but I definitely wanted to record them this is a fat tailed scorpion definitely venomous super awesome we all know our friends from supreme gecko let's see some pictus geckos all right so Wally actually has two pictus geckos here that look really nice this one uh, this I think it's a snow it's a very white uh, pictus gecko looks really nice so you can definitely see all the uh, the white instead of brownish skin. So that is really nice. But I'm gonna have to say that this one is actually my favorite. This guy looks really cool. The pattern is completely different to the other ones that I have seen from him. And $35? Man, that's a steal. This guy looks awesome. Another cool little gecko. Chondrodactyl is something, that's the only thing that I always remember. This is a 
sand snake. I have no idea what morph or what. You guys know that I don't know too much about snakes, but I still want to show a little bit for everyone. That I know for sure it's a king snake. is cool. Milk snake I believe. I rarely get to see uh, captive bred fire skinks. So this is cool. This is definitely a skink that uh, I believe that uh, deserves more uh, popularity. I think I said that right. But yeah you know what I mean. They definitely need to, to, uh, to be known a little bit more. see some leopard geckos oh yeah so this is a male yep. male look at those eyes are they red they are yeah, yeah. Albino. that is awesome that's a good looking leopard gecko one of the better ones we've produced all right let's jump from leopard geckos to chahuas this guy's I definitely need eventually. One or two. Oh yeah. Man, that, that white patch on the neck, that looks really nice. That right there, that is an upside down Chahua gecko. One of a kind. That's a good looking crested gecko. Jason definitely works with some really awesome geckos. Look at that one. That one is super nice. Look at this little guy. And only $300. some bugs look at this tiny thing yeah. super super tiny there are several species of mantids in here they sure love to dance just imagine looking this on the outside. No freaking way you would see it. Looks just like a leaf. So freaking awesome. J let's jump right back into leopard geckos. Well, hello there. Oh, <laughs> that was funny. I don't know what was that, but that was funny. beautiful leopard gecko let's look at some of the best custom cages these are nice I will definitely be getting something from them hopefully very soon actually hopefully we'll see that's a really nice big enclosure kind of looks like a like six foot for the water a little nice ramp so that would be the uh, the basking spot. Look at all of that. Just imagine this in your room. That would be nice. Let's see some cool snakes. That is a cool snake. Oh wait, there's two. <laughs> I thought it was only one snake. Well, it's still cool. Let's see a warm up python. You ever have anything like the T negatives or the T positives? I have T positive. I'm gonna show you something unique. 
This is the only plant that when it blooms, instead of getting flowers, it gets chameleons. How cool is that? Okay. These are actually some nice ball pythons. pick my interest man look at that one that one is nice all right something aquatic actually which is cool axolotls yes that is the way that i pronounce them i'm used to it